example I want I want to mention is that we're very geared right now on empowering agile delivery, right? The way that software companies today, the higher performing ones certainly, are working and have been working really for some time, right? We we don't think it's in the security interest of the FedRAMP program or the U.S. government to be a constant bottleneck that makes it take a year longer than it should to get a firewall up on the internet or something like that, right? We want to, it is in our interest to see more security patches, features, features generally. It's in the government's interest for this stuff to be moving. Um, and so, you know, we, that one of the big pain points that I know a lot of folks have comes around what in FedRAMP speak is the significant change request process that's getting a lot of attention from us internally. Raise your hand if you know what a PR is. Uh -huh. A lot yeah. of hands in the room are up. We're like, them out. in the live stream. I hope you also raise your hand. <laughs> right, and and we would we would like to really move towards that being a non-blocking process for the federal government. That that may mean that there's more information that needs to come through. That that may mean that there's uh, a little bit more work in terms of you know understanding what the process is going to be you know, on the on the CSP side to support that. But what we want is to actually change our machine to to operate asynchronously, right? To put it in a little bit of an engineering uh, kind of analogy here. Um, and we think that's going to uh, get us more of what we want from a security perspective um, and definitely something we'll be interested in working with interested folks on as the year goes on.